Hey guys, on today's video we're going to be updating your iPad, so let's just go right into your settings. Under your settings, you will see your very first option on the top left hand side. It's going to see your device's name or your name. From there, just use iCloud in order to make a backup. If you guys have no more space on your iCloud, don't worry about it. Hook it up to your computer and use iTunes in order to make that backup. And if you're having any problems, you guys can also use iTunes in order to update it. In case for Mac, if you're up to date, then you guys can use Finder in order to update and also back up your iPad. Anyways, once we're done that, we can go right into General, which is down here below. So just go into General, and then your second option will be Software Update. Under Software Update, we should see this, and then 13.6, which is the latest one right now. So we're just going to tap on Install Now. Now some of you may see Download, and that's because it hasn't downloaded just yet. And that's all right, it should say download, install. Some of you might only see install now, and that's just because it downloaded already. However, no big deal, it's the same thing. Once I tap on install now, it's gonna run the update. If it's downloading the update, then it's not a huge deal if your iPad turns off for any reason. However, once it's installing, it's a big deal. Cause then we might have to restore it it's a whole process and we want to avoid that. However, that's also why we made that backup. So make sure to at least have 50% of your battery. And if you guys even have, let's say 98% of your battery, I would still recommend just hook it up to some electricity just in case you guys don't want anything to go wrong when you're installing this update. Anyways, for now, we're just gonna click on install now. It's gonna ask us for a passcode if you guys have one. Once we put that in, it's gonna verify the update and then it's just gonna show us a black screen and then restart. So what we're gonna see next is an Apple logo in a loading bar. That's gonna load pretty slow and then it's gonna do this again. We're gonna see another Apple logo in a loading bar. This time it's gonna go pretty fast and then we're just gonna be done with the update. So again, this loading bar should go pretty fast compared to the first one and again, that's just a few minutes. So maybe you're looking at the first bar maybe for five minutes and the second one should be just about three to two minutes. So after that you should see a white screen Apple logo without a loading bar and then it's gonna take you here. If you guys have a passcode go ahead and answer it right now. And that would be it. Once you answer that you should be able to get back into your iPad and that would be it for this video. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.